Anmer Hall is the 10-bedroom red brick Georgian property that was Kate Middleton's personal project for two years. It stands on the Queen's Sandringham estate in Norfolk, and Her Majesty gifted it to William and Kate when they got married. After extensive refurbishment, the couple moved in along with Prince George and Princess Charlotte in 2015, and even after the family moves to Kensington Palace full-time later in the year, it will remain their country residence. So what did Kate do with her blank canvas? Architect Charles Morris worked on the remodeling and added a garden room, while interior designer Ben Pentreth oversaw the decor. He had previously worked with Kate's father-in-law Prince Charles and apparently coaxed Kate into being more experimental with color, encouraging her to go for an emerald green dining room. However, much of the rest of the home has a softer, more traditional vibe. See for yourself ahead. Towels and hangers and rugs. Oh my. When Kate went shopping for floor coverings at Cotswold Oriental Rugs, she snapped up a few Turkish kilims that have a kind of flat tapestry weave. Owner Simon Knight later said, she was looking for things for bedrooms, so she wanted softer pastel shades rather than strong colors. It seems Kate's love of all things blue doesn't end with her wardrobe. After she picked up blue towels and blue gingham hangers at Zara Home, one of the sales assistants revealed, she definitely likes blue. Everything she seemed to look at was blue but not for babies. She must just like the color. A dream in cream. When this Duchess snapped picture was released to mark Princess Charlotte's first birthday, it wasn't stated which room it was taken in, but because of the light, pale color scheme, it seems to be one of the more personal rooms in the house, and it's a brave parent who opts for shades of cream, for the carpet, walls, and corner sofa, when there are two young children tearing around. Other items of note are the pretty floor-length cream drapes with blue-gray print in the pink and white chivari chair. Gingham Girl, when pictures were released to mark Princess Charlotte's six-month birthday, we had another peek into the interior of Anmer Hall, this time with this armchair, covered in vintage effect blue and cream gingham fabric from luxury upholsterers Brunswick and Phil's. A miniature throne fit for a princess. In another picture released to mark Princess Charlotte's first birthday, we perhaps got a glimpse into another room at Emmer Hall. This one has a pink pattern rug, a deep faded cream and beige striped low-backed sofa piled with mix and match cushions, and of course a mini princess size white wicker armchair. Let's go outside. Thanks so the pictures released to mark Prince George's third birthday, and a comment made from Kate at a public engagement earlier this year. We have an idea of what the Anmer Gardens are like too. We know that a simple rope swing hanging from a tree with William and Catherine engraved on the wooden plank seat is thought to have been a wedding present from Kate's parents, while in another shot, George and English cocker spaniel Lupel shared a plant travel rug. The rustic, country feel is added to by the Cambridge's brood of chickens.